Hey, it's Anno, what's Orsia, and this is my level 1 to 99 fishing guide for the 07 RuneScape servers. So the first series of method is for players who want to get the best experience possible, and what I recommend to do from level 1 to 24 is to complete a single short quest called Seaslug that will give you a 7k experience in fishing, which is a lot in a very short amount of time. Then from level 24 to 58, what you want to do is fly fishing, and then all the way to level 99, barbarian fishing. If you follow this series of methods, it will take you about 225 hours to get level 99 in fishing, and in bonus, you will get 1.2 million experience in agility and strength. In the other end, if your goal is to make profit with fishing, then this is what I recommend. So it's still sea slug to get level 24, then fly fishing to 55, then after of that it's different, you want to fish lobster to 65, then all the way to level 99, what I recommend is to fish swordfish. Um, you could also train with sharks, but like you will soon see, sharks give less profit and less experience per hour than swordfish. Okay, so first of all, let's talk about fly fishing, the way you will train from level 24 to 55 or 58, depending on the series of method you want to train. So by doing fly fishing, what you're actually catching is either trout or salmon, it's totally random, and below you can see the experience per hour and the GP per hour approximately. Okay, so for the equipment, this is what I recommend, so the two things you will need is a fly fishing rod and a lot of feathers and also to get to the location where you will be fishing them, uh, one of the spot, you will need to have two Laroon, two water rune, and a little bit of quince. So yeah, the first spot that I recommend to fish them, and it's actually the best spot, is in Chilo Village, and you will need to have completed the quest Chilo Village to get there, and if you want to get there fast, you also want to complete the quest Plague City to unlock the Ardun Teleport spell. So to get there, you use Ardun Teleport, you run to the docks, you go to Brim Avon, and from that location you want to go uh, south to a little cart, use the cart, and you will be inside Chilo Village. If you haven't done the quest, then there's another spot, it's not as good as the other one, because you will need to drop all the fish on the floor. Um, it's in Varag, well, Barbarian Village, you teleport to Varag, run west, and that's pretty much it. Okay, so first of all, you want to use the Ardun teleport spell to be in Ardun, run southeast to the docks, select yes, teleport to Brim Avon, then from there you want to use the little card there, use the travel option, and you will be inside the Chilo Village. Um, now there's a bank south, you can drop the coins or you can simply go and start fishing right away. Um, you will drop the coins after. So simply use the lure option of a fishing spot and you will start getting trout and salmon and really good experience. When your bank is full, you don't have to drop in because there's a bank, simply drop them into your bank and simply go back fishing. Okay, so now let's talk about barbarian fishing, which is the most efficient way to train fishing. And you will train that way from level 58 all the way to level 99. Um, to use this method, there is an extra requirement. You will need at least level 45 in agility and strength. And you will also need to have completed the part uh, for barbarian fishing in the barbarian training. And to do that, you simply want to talk with Otto. We'll also put a link in the description, but it's a really, really easy mini quest. Okay, so those are the experience rate that you can expect. So it, at level 99, it's about 60k experience per hour in fishing with a bonus experience of 5k in strength and agility. The ratio is about 1 out of 11. Okay, so when doing barbarian fishing, this is the inventory I recommend. So first of all, a barbarian road, and you'll also need feathers or fishing bait. They are pretty much the same thing. Uh, for the equipment, I recommend to bring a game necklace to get to the location where you'll be fishing them very fast. And a good thing to bring is also a ring of life in case you're away from keyboard and you're attacked by a random event, so you won't lose all your feathers. The place where we'll be training Barbarian Fishing is south of the Barbarian Outpost and the fastest way to get there is to use a game necklace Then simply run south and if you go a little bit south from the fishing spot you will get to the Otto Grotto uh, which is the place where you will start the mini um, quest for Barbarian Training. Okay, so first of all, you want to use the reuse road option of a fishing spot to start collecting fish and getting experience. That's 
pretty much it. The hard part of boarding and fishing is to drop the fish. You can do it manually, simply uh, select the drop option one at a time. What I recommend to do is to use mouse keys. If you don't know how to use them or what they are, then simply check the link in the description to my mouse keys guide. Um, so basically your goal is that your jump range of the mouse keys is exactly one fish. So you simply right click, press the 2 to go down, then 5 to select the fish. So right click, 2, 5, right click, 2, 5, right click, 2, 5, right click, 2, 5. That's pretty much the basic, then you can do it a little bit faster. And when you want to drop a full inventory, you go at max speed. Um, if the last fish doesn't drop, it's normal, it's not really the end of the world. It's simply that your jump range, range wasn't exactly perfect. Okay, so now let's talk about lobster, the method you will use from level 55 to 65 if you want money. So catching lobster um, is pretty bad experience per hour, about 16k, and it's also crappy GP per hour, but it's still the best way to make profit at that level. At level 65 you can switch to swordfish and go all the way to level 99. At level 99 it's about 35k experience per hour with 60k GP profit per hour which is still bad but it's the best thing you will ever get with fishing. And finally at level 80 to 99 you can switch for sharks but like you can see it's a little bit less GP per hour and it's far less experience per hour, nearly the half of swordfish. For the equipment you will need a lobster pot if you want to catch lobster or a harpoon if you want to catch swordfish or shark. You don't need any feathers or fishing bait and you will also need a law rune and 5 air rune to be able to teleport to the location where the fishing spot are. The place where we'll be fishing is in the Karibai fishing spot and the fastest way to get there is to use Camelot teleport, run south then east and you will be um, at the fishing spot. There is also a bank in this village. Okay, so from the bank you want to run east and go to the fishing spot. So there, there are a couple different fishing spots. If your goal is to fish sharks, then you want to use the harpoon option of a net and harpoon fishing spot. If your goal is to get lobster, then you want to use the cage option of a cage and harpoon fishing spot. And if your goal is to get swordfish, you want to use the harpoon option of a cage and harpoon um, spot. Don't forget that we'll always get both tuna and swordfish when trying to get swordfish. It's normal. So yeah, it's already the end of the video. I hope you liked it. And don't forget to click the annotation on the screen if you want to check my level 1 to 99 prayer guide for the RuneScape 07 servers.